Welcome to Trucking with Fitz. Today we're going to jump back uh, into the dry van world. Uh, we haul a load from Cedar Rapids, Iowa up to, uh, where was it, Greeley, Iowa, and then we pick up in Dyersville. Um, and we're going to deliver that load tomorrow in Humble. So stay tuned for some trucking. All right, welcome to the Cedar Rapids Airport and welcome to the dry van again. I guess you saw it yesterday, but didn't really talk about it too much. We are, uh, we're at Cedar Rapids Airport at obviously FedEx. So that's really random. I'm getting two pallets and I'm gonna get out of here. So, yeah. It's going up to a wind farm. All right, we're loaded. That was the simple, well, two pallets. And uh, hopefully they have a way to get this to the back of the trailer because I don't. <laughs> I don't. I bet they do. Those are my lonely pallets. And uh, apparently this is for FedEx Custom Critical is what this is actually for. Oh, I don't know, I'm lost. Hopefully I don't get into a can of worms when I get there and can't get it in and around where I need to be. Oh, okay. We're gonna get rolling here. This could get interesting. Well, that was interesting. We're still we're still in Cedar Rapids here. Um, it took longer for them to figure out that it was okay that I left with the amount of pallets that I had than it did to load the pallets gotta love that hurry up and wait people don't got their their crap in order oil still quick we're gonna get up there hopefully they have everything they need to get me unloaded because those pallets are halfway up my trailer and uh, either they need a dock or they need a telehandler or they need something to go get in there and get it or they just need a pallet jack to stick up in there so I can move it um, I was not told to have any of those things, so. We will see. All right, we're out of here. Off the property. Now, to get on down the road, it's not gonna take us that long. An hour and a half? Something like that. It's north of Manchester, so we'll see you in a bit. All right, we're on location, basically. Once we get into a gear here. Probably gonna hop out in a second here and walk down to where I need to be because I don't think they have a dock and uh, Maybe I'll give them a call if I have a phone number. We, yeah, I, I just gotta see all that. They do have a telehandler sitting there, being operated currently. So that's an option. But for now, we're just gonna pull over to the side and figure this out. All right, that was painless once I found the right person. Thankfully, they came and found me. Um, yeah, they used the telehandler like I thought they would. Just reached in there and grabbed it. Pretty simple. We're gonna get out of here. It took five minutes. No time at all. Communicate to everybody that needs communicated to. We're gonna pull out here, not very far. And 
just chill for a little while, I might need to stop. All right, someplace new. We are headed around back. Shipping, receiving. Labeled wonderfully. To the back we go. I already know the docks are in the back. I used map view, or a uh, satellite view. Always smart to do that before you get to a place. And let's see what kind of situation we got here. There's what, one dock? Oh, it won't be too bad. All right. We're gonna get in here and get checked in and see what the plan is. All right, we're checked in. Oh, gotta release the brakes, Wayne. Maybe you can see a little bit here. Put my tires right on that line is what I want to do. just one pallet. Um, easy peasy. I'm gonna head inside and make sure they put it all the way to the front and uh, see you in a second. Well, that would that couldn't have been easier. It's just one long pallet. We're gonna get pulled forward here and close our doors. And uh, they're waiting on a Delaying. Well, that shouldn't take very long. He's zooming around trying to find the right person. We're gonna do our thing and get this door closed. And uh, we should have our bill waiting shortly. Flat in Humboldt, Iowa. Man, if I wanted to, I could get a lot in this trailer. I just don't know how to find parcels. We won't go far. We will. Wait. Eat lunch. And, uh, We'll leave in a bit. Let's go find a truck stop. All right, I'm gonna go back in and see if they have that bill. All right, we're loaded with our one pallet. Doors closed. We're gonna go find ourselves a place to stop. I have no rush this afternoon. Um, not planning on picking anything else up. If I can find another partial. I would do that, but I don't think I'm gonna find another partial. The load's paying good enough, I don't need a partial. 
I mean, it's not paying great. I just don't have any deadhead at the side. So it makes it work. All right. We'll catch you on down the road. All right. We stopped here at lunch. We're going to get some fuel today because we are running low. And uh, got a nice trip tomorrow. I got a load booked uh, for after my delivery in Humboldt. So that's exciting. It's picking up in Alden. It's animal feed. Or at least it's uh, ingredients for animal feed. And uh, yeah. I'm gonna get uh, loaded in heavyweight at a truck stop. Uh, not hard to do. And that one delivers in Marion. Uh, let's see, which pump do I want? Let's do the outside. Oh, oh, this yard is off. Has a bunch of potholes. Ow, that hurt. We are going to get filled up here. We're about an hour from the house. So. leave you guys with today um thanks for watching stay tuned for some more uh drive and content subscribe to the channel you'll see some more of that and uh hit the thumbs up button comment down below and we'll see you on the next one